Hello everyone, this is Vanilla Vanille V from INDU and today I'm going to be making a tutorial on how to do a easy and simple catalog product page. Um, I am making catalog product like display background images um, and I'm going to be selling them in my file sales and I got asked if uh, when I posted some pictures of them in on Facebook. I got asked if they were fully coded and I was kind of like, well, it's not an entire product page, it's just like the background and so it, you know, it's not something that needs to be fully coded. And then I got to thinking that there's probably some people out there who don't even know how to code something simple like just a picture. And um, so I decided to make this tutorial to explain um, how to use uh, properly use my backgrounds that I'm going to be selling and then I'm going to be posting a link of this video um, uh, in my file sale thread for people to watch. Um, a lot of this stuff many of you are already going to know um, but this video is more for people who are who are starting out and don't know it or maybe people who have just never done it before. So when I say backgrounds uh, this is what I'm talking about. I actually create these and then you have the ability um, you know to take pictures and to set them up something like this so that in your product page um, you can have a really nice looking display um, this is mine here this is one of my pages um, I made this background image and then I take pictures of my products in IMView obviously and edit it all in uh, Photoshop and then um, I use a code um, I really easy to code all this and I put it in here and put it into my catalog um, I used to get product pages I used to actually buy um, a whole fully coded product page something like what Anri has here and I found them very confusing, difficult to work with, and oftentimes they just simply did not work. Um, and I wanted something really simple, like what Wims had, where it's just it's a really big product picture. It just seemed so simple. Um, here's another one, uh, Miss Maya. As you can see, it's just real simple. Um, there are many more, but I just picked out a couple. And um, and I realized that I could actually do this all of myself. I did have a little bit of help to first get me started, and that's why I'm making this for you so that you know what I learned, you can learn. Um, all the extra coding that you see, like this section here, and you know the what what my what my avatar is wearing, which is being modeled, the related products, my banners, and my derivables, all were coded. Um, from GAF210. I love this guy. Um, he's helped me out so much. You just go to the developers tools and um, see here you have the banner code. Here's the product code generator. Um, here's the uh, the related products, the derivables. So everything that you see, oops, everything you see here um, besides this right here, everything else was done through GAF so it makes it he just does all the work for you it's really easy you just follow the instructions and that's all there is to it um, for but now I'm going to be talking about how to code the picture part now with each of the rooms that I will be selling in my thread I will be also sending you this code right here um, obviously I have stuff I have directions in it so it's very easy to use um, so once you um, once you create your background, you know you finish putting the products in the in the picture, um, and you have your picture ready to go. You're going to want to upload it to a photo album. You can use Tiny Pick or Photo Bucket, but I don't like those sites. Um, they lag really bad. I just don't like them. So somebody suggested that I actually use iView's own photo albums, and that is uh, what I do. Um, as you can see I have several here so you just would create an album upload your picture into it and um, and then you oops, here we go you would use this code right here and you would put that right here where it says you put your image code 
So you want the direct link. If you use Tiny Pick or Photo Bucket, you're going to want to make sure to use the direct link. Um, and then here would be where your catalog link goes. Obviously, we just go to your catalog page. There it is. You put that there, and then put your name here. And then, I, and then it would be completely ready. All you would need to do is, um, after you submit your product, you would want to go to add your hot, add the Hotmail description. You'd want to put that code right in here. Submit it. Um, and then obviously you'd want to put it into peer preview. That's all you would need to do um, for your page to be completely done then. If you wanted to do extra, like you know all of these type of things, then I would highly suggest just going um, to, like I said, go to go to GAFs. Um, everything is really easily done for you. And then I would highly suggest um, if you have either use your, your Word or use Notepad and then create something like this. Get ev Put everything um, together in it so it's just really easy and then to save that and then you can just keep reusing this over and over by just tweaking a little bit you know putting in um, you know putting in your names there see here's mine here's my code that is just like yours here um, obviously mine is fully fully all filled out and everything and then you know you just continually tweak this but then you just always have your code it's really easy to use um, like I said you wouldn't have to you could just just do this, but um, but that's basically really all there is to it. If you wanted a fully coded, if you said like, hey, I really like your background images, but you know, I don't want to do it this way. It's too simple. You want something that's really fancy, like something you know, like Anery's. Then what you could do is you you could do a get a product um, page code um, and just ask the person who's making it for you. You know, give them. Well, I clicked off my image here, but. Um, you know, get the take, give them you know the the background image and say, hey, build a code around this, and most of them can do that easily. So um, you could use it either way, but if you don't want to go into all you know, pay the extra to have the whole product page coded, and you you just want something really easy and simple that you can do yourself, then this this is how I do it. Um, you know, it's just it's just that easy. You just. Um, I think feel like I've rambled more than actually helped, but hopefully I have helped. It's just that easy. Um, like I said, um, I will be sending this code with each of the products that each of the backgrounds that I sell. So just um, you know, up finish your finish your your background, upload it, follow these instructions, paste it submit it and you're pretty much done. I mean that's all you would have to do. So I do hope that this helped out. Um, thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye.